Do unicorns really exist? Well, in this case they do. Let's go. Hey guys, BT Kicks here, back at it again. Well, welcome to another episode of Kaki Cartel. And today, we've got a performance review of the Adidas ProBounce 2018. So Adidas released the Adidas ProBounce 2018 in this Christos Porzingis PE edition. As you can see, there are next colorways. You can see Porzingis' name on the toe right here. And this is honestly one of my favorite design aspects of the shoe. We've got the unicorn, check it out full-length graphic with a within the translucent outsole. How sick is this? So this is honestly one of my favorite design aspects of the shoe. The hits of orange, black as well, definitely adds a certain pop to the shoe. And yeah, definitely fire on court. So moving on to the performance aspect of these shoes, starting off with the traction as always. So the Adidas Pro Bounce 2018, well this edition anyway, this colorway anyway, features a translucent outsole you can see here, it's a spiral pattern. You know, generally, translucent outsoles don't perform as well, but Adidas really hit the nail on these and the traction performs pretty well on clean courts, dusty courts, mildly dusty courts. Even if dust starts to clog up here, a quick wipe and these will get you covered. Good to go. Traction is definitely a strong point of this shoe. The best way I could describe this traction is that it is just reliable. It's consistent, it's reliable, if I do not know the condition of the court I'll be playing in, I'll always have these in my bag. These are something I can trust, I'll slip them on, and I know traction, I'll be covered. Moving on to the materials of the shoe, Adidas uses what they call a forged fiber, which is essentially prime knit, but just slightly thicker for durability. Um, this material is lightweight, it's flexible as well. Once you break them in, once it conforms around your foot, it feels really comfortable, even from the initial try-on in store. The more I put my foot in, I knew these are gonna be really comfortable. So even though they may seem a little thick, the materials are actually quite flexible. It moves to your foot, so it won't have that pinching feeling, unlike some shoes that I've used before. You lace them all the way to the top, break them in, they're good to go. Moving on to the cushion, the Adidas Pro Bounce uses full-length bounce cushioning. So bounce cushioning offers really good court feel, at the same time giving you a slight bounce back and yeah if you haven't tried bounce cushioning before I highly recommend you definitely check these out bounce is actually really good uh, it's comparable to boost obviously boost is life but if, def if you definitely want to try something new bounce is the way to go overall I feel that bounce cushioning is a really well balanced foam it's light it's springy it's responsive Definitely a go-to in my rotation. Moving on to the support and lockdown. Since this is a high, the Adidas Pro Bounce features a sort of padded ankle collar here. You can see, once you put your foot in, you'll be covered. Definitely really comfortable. Give you that really good support if you're um, you know, a little bit skeptical about ankle support. Fun fact though, I play in lows most of the time, and it's a myth that uh, most players go when they say that, oh, I always have to play in high because I am worried about ankle support. That's not true. So I play in lows majority of the time. So even playing in highs, I really think that uh, the support really comes from the overall base of the shoe, the torsional plate, as well as the overall lockdown with your laces. Support wise, these have you good, definitely really solid, no frills. If you are wearing an ankle brace, however, definitely try the in-store because the ankle collar around here can be a bit snug if you're wearing ankle, ankle braces. But apart from that, solid lockdown, solid support. Coming down to the fit, these fit true to size for me. I'm a size 10 usually and I wear a size 10 in these and these fit true to size. Uh, narrow footers might want to go half size down, but since I'm a slightly wide footed player, I definitely appreciate uh, a true to size fit in these. But as always, I do recommend you try this in store to get the fit that best suits you. Overall, I think the Adidas Pro Bounce 2018 is a solid shoe, a really good performer on court. No frills, just put them on and play and you're good to go. No gimmicks, just straight up bounce cushioning, great materials, great fit. 
good support, good lockdown, and the traction is just a really strong point of the shoe. These do also come in the low top version, so if you're like me and you like playing low tops, definitely go check out the low top version as well as the high top version. So overall, I highly recommend these shoes to any players from positions one to five. It is one of those shoes where you really don't have to think about it. Just put them on and go play. Definitely a really solid performer on court. So that takes care of the performance review of the Adidas Pro Bounce 2018 in the uh, Chris Sauce Porzingis edition. Let me know what you guys think. If you tried this shoe on, if you're going to try the low top version. Also, let me know in the comment section down below if you want me to review any other performance basketball shoes. So thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe down to Huddle down below. Also, follow me on Instagram at BTKicks where I will be reviewing as well as previewing some of the sneakers that I'll be testing before the performance review. So, a performance teaser. So, stay tuned, guys. We out.